When you go to a third world country and put in a situation where you're doing service in a place where you see there's really a lot of need, you can't stop and you kind of feel this innate need to help further. So the Wash U Guatemala Initiative, I like to call Wuji for short. It's a project under the EW Beer and Engineers Without Borders umbrella. Um, I traveled to Guatemala this past summer and worked at Roosevelt Hospital, which is the largest public hospital in Guatemala. Um, so I went down there and worked on respiratory ventilators, a particular model, because a lot of the equipment in use in the hospital there um, is donated from first world countries and is expired and no longer as a need in our hospitals here. I came back and had identified a lot of problems within the hospital and the hospital system, um, including machine errors, instrument errors, things that need repairs, but also um, they don't have electronic medical records or an EMR. They don't have good communication within different departments. They don't have a lot of different needs um, that are really basic and necessary for a sustainable hospital system. So Wuji has a few goals for this year and we're trying to make this an annual trip and not only have another trip but look for more projects because there's so many ways that Wash U and just engineers and engineering minds can help the hospital in every different field. And as a student, it's really been a motivating force in my studies because I can be sitting and doing a problem set and not really know what I'm doing and being a little frustrated and it can be late at night and I can have a lot on my plate, but I know that there is real world application because I've seen it. And that's really been incredible to have.